today we are discussing another logical coding previous video we discussed write a program to check the num the given number is armstrong or not but here also we discussed armstrong number but we have to display armstrong number between 1 to 1000 or 1 to n okay the armstrong number definition is same what is armstrong number the number what are the digits the power of that sum of that number is called armstrong number you know already knows armstrong number you already print the program the number is to, to check the number is armstrong number or not here i want to display armstrong number between 1 to 1000 or 1 to n what are the armstrong numbers in that between the interval or between the uh, between the number okay i want to display okay i will open the eclipse here Eclipse launch already open it. Sorry, I already open it here. I remove this close project. Okay, again, I will open okay i will select a folder okay park i will create a new class class am between i will take am between armstrong sorry i will take armstrong number between between okay you will you take whatever class name but i will take for understandable armstrong an between okay i select main method then i will finish okay what was the program write a program to display armstrong number between one to thousand uh, we are displaying Armstrong number between 1 to 1000 for we are using for loop okay for for loop for iterating for loop for loop uh, between uh, the number 1 to 1000 we have to uh, come out one checking one one two that's why we are using for loop okay I use for loop for loop int i is equal to one i will initialize one i less than or equal to thousand we are checking one to thousand that's why using less than or equal to thousand then i increment i plus plus okay okay the program is what what you previous video what you uh, discussed the program uh, write a program uh, uh, Armstrong number is same logic but here I I I taking one one for loop here and I am taking uh, one more uh, variable and you can see here okay I am taking variable int int n is equal to sorry i'm taking end for reminder okay reminder okay you know about Armstrong number we have to uh, take that reminder and multiply that reminder yeah you know int rem i will take then i will store end c is equal to i okay i will store uh sorry i will store I value in n for using while loop we have we have to check in while loop that's why I've stored I value i is equal to n yeah then I will take another variable in uh, data type in variable name is r I will check in each value r is equal to zero okay okay then I then I am using while loop while loop while loop i am using while and greater than zero okay and greater than zero 
here the same uh, we have to take a reminder of that number reminder is equal to n modulus 10 n modulus 10 stored in reminder then i will take on is equal to reminder multiplication reminder multiplication reminder okay plus r i want to add that plus r okay then again it will divide it of that number after the uh, multiply multiplication we have to divide what was the quotient again we have to what was the what was the quotient again we have to check while n is greater than zero we have to check okay then i am i am taking n is equal to n by 10 okay then if this condition is satisfied then i print if if what is we have to print the r value var is equal to i we have to print i values how many numbers are armstrong numbers we have to print that so i i take here i taken taken here i i is equal to i we have to print i values okay here I will I will here I will check the condition R is equal to I Armstrong number is equal to what is I I one two thousand we have to checking if is equal to that number is is equal to Armstrong number I value is equal to Armstrong number then we have to print system dot out dot print ln we have to print only I value okay I value we have to print only I value okay I will take here double quotation okay uh, it will print one by one okay yeah okay let's let us execute the program it will running or not we have to check and java application okay yeah here one is a i'm strong number 153 is i'm strong number 370 is 70 is i'm strong number 371 is i'm strong number 407 is an strong number it is between it is uh, displaying between 1 to 1000 1 to 1000 the 4 5 5 1 2 3 yeah five numbers are and strong numbers five five numbers are and strong number okay in between 1 to 1000 if i uh, here use 1 to 1000 okay if i take here one to one to five hundred okay one to five hundred how many numbers are going to it will display okay i will again execute run as java application okay yeah it will display this number only because the answer number between one to five hundred is four not seven up to four not seven only okay i will take change here one to seven hundred okay run as java application yeah it will display one to this this much this up to 407 only okay i will take one two thousand nine hundred i will take one to nine hundred nine hundred okay how many numbers are uh, amstrong number okay okay to display for up to 407 if i take ten thousand how much armstrong numbers are yeah why it is displaying this much only because i'm taking reminder three if i if i taking here it is it four five five okay between one to thousand i will take here one to year thousand one two thousand I will take one more reminder it will display one to thousand one to thousand i'm strong number okay now you can change here change the output you can see the output console okay it will display one to okay one to thousand yeah 
Now, in, in between 1 to 1000, only one Armstrong member. 4 and 4 digit. 1, 2, 3, 4, only one Armstrong number. If I, if I uh, remove this to 2, 1 to 2000, how, how many Armstrong number? Now it will change the output, okay? Yeah. 1, 1 and 1, 6, 3, 4. Okay, one is Armstrong number and one six three four is Armstrong number. Okay, previous video we also we have to return this exam. Uh, then uh, we have to check this example one six three four is Armstrong number. Okay, one to two thousand. If I take here one to five thousand, how many Armstrong number? Okay, how many Armstrong number? One six three four only. Okay, if I take nine thousand, how many Armstrong number? Yeah, now one to nine thousand four digit power of that number is one one six three four eight two zero eight. These are the Armstrong number digit four digit power of that four. Okay, okay, how uh, loop is working? I will show you. Okay. okay, I will delete this whole thing. Okay, here I am using for loop. Using for loop, for loop, for, for loop, i is equal to 1. i is equal to 1. Okay, I will change the color to black. Yeah, i is equal to 1. Then 1 to 9000 or 1 to n, whatever, 1 to 9000. I will take here four digit and in time reminder you know reminder I will take that reminder then I will store n is equal to i I will store value i value in n i value in n okay then I will using while loop I taking here n is greater than zero here reminder is equal to n by 10 then that reminder n is equal to n by 10 okay I will take reminder Reminder, what is n value? n is 1. 1 divisible of 10. What is the reminder? 1 only. arm is equal to arm is equal to 1 multiplication, 1 multiplication, 1 multiplication, 1 multiplication, 1. What is arm plus 0? Okay, then n 0, n is equal to n by 10. Then again, checking condition what uh, n by n is equal to n by 10 means what is the quotient quotient is 0 quotient is 0 0 is greater than 0 0 is greater than 0 no 0 is not a greater than 0 0 is equal to 0 the condition is false it will come out while loop and checking r is equal to i what is the arm value r is 0 is equal to 0 is equal to what is sorry arm value is 1 arm value is 1 is equal to 1 yes it is 1 then it will print i value i is equal to 1 this is loop up to 1000 time it will running running it will printing printing iterating iterating here you will just observe if i come for the for loop then again int r is equal to 0 it, it cannot add it, it it will again from the for loop it, it becomes 0 in the while loop, it arm, arm becomes adding, arm is adding, but in the in, in outside the arm is, is it becomes zero. Before coming the while loop, it, it becomes initializing arm, arm is zero. Okay. It is we have to focus and yeah, this is a program to write write a uh, write a program to print Armstrong number between one to thousand or one to n and uh, okay thank you for watching please subscribe my channel and if you missed the video of armstrong number please uh, 
I will display the link in the comment section. You just check it and watch it. If you, if, if you clear the Armstrong number, then you will understand this program. And thank you for watching. See you soon in the next video. Thank you.